Hey guys, I hope you had a fantastic weekend. It is the Monday after Easter. Spring is a great time to get new cleaning appliances, just a fresh new start. Some of my cleaning issues when I'm washing the dishes are that rags get really stinky. I hate dealing with it. I have boiled my rags and done all this hoodoo foodoo to my rags and they still continually stink after a while. So I was trying to look for something that doesn't stink um, and that doesn't scrape your pants either. So the first cleaning item that I ordered were these bad boys. As you can see, these are silicone sponges. You can kind of see the texture. It's really soft. It doesn't feel like it would scrape your pans at all. And these are the cool essential ones. And I bought them in this shape. Uh, there were other shapes online. They came in a pack of three, but I was, I was really getting my hopes up about this product and sadly, I hated them. <laughs> so, I mean, it might work for you because actually um, it's very soft, so it doesn't scrape your pants, but it also doesn't really get too much of the gunk off of your pants. These were really hard to use. The shape wasn't that great. It was kind of hard to hold, and then you have to put the soap on there. It just didn't really work out, and it honestly made me dread doing my dishes. I have to give these a two out of 10, so yeah. I looked on Amazon and I looked up soft haired brushes for cleaning dishes. And what I found was this tool. And as you can see, it's by Glute, Goot, <laughs> Glute. And it has soft bristles. They're very, very soft. In fact, my husband didn't want to use it on the dishes because he thought it was too nice to be used on the dishes. And I still use it because I like it. The only thing is the hairs sometimes tend to fall out. I would give this a, I'd probably give it a seven out of 10. I really liked it. So that was a lot better than the silicone sponges. On each one of these products, you have to pour the soap onto the brush and then clean. So I got this. It's a good grips brush that has a soap dispenser on the top and all you do is squeeze it. And this one was awesome. I think this was my husband's favorite product. The only thing is look at these bristles. They are very tough, really simple. I still use this one again. Um, and it's pretty easy to pour the soap in. You just screw the top off and you can add soap that way. It kind of has to be full of soap before you can get a really good amount of soap out. But also when that happens, I tend to like not see the soap coming out and then I push really hard and then a ton would come out more than I needed. Overall though, I would have to give this an eight out of 10, it made dishwashing really easy. I found this, I still have the package for it because it was my most recent one, but it's a self-cleaning washcloth by Lunatech. And it says right here, you'll never need to wash it. Um, oh, this is gross. By the way, I have not washed it. So, cause I wanted to, so it might be gross that I'm holding it up, but I wanted to get the full stench of what it would smell like if I didn't wash it for two weeks. <laughs> so that might be gross, but I wanted to test this to the limit. A lot of holes in it. It just has a lot of threads weaved loosely together, so it dries so fast. It dries so quickly. And that's the key to not having the mold or mildew, or whatever it is, build up in there. And so after two weeks, no smell, no smell. And that is me not washing it, using it thoroughly when I'm cleaning. We don't have a dishwasher, so we have used this. 
I really liked this and I was surprised how much I liked it because I thought it would be kind of like that silicone sponge where it wouldn't lather at all. It would just be like I was rubbing two pieces of plastic together on my dishes, but actually if you get the soap on there, it really does lather. In conclusion, this one I would have to give a 9 out of 10. I think I was really surprised at how well this did. And so out of all the products, I really loved this rag. I hope you guys have gained something from this. If you're in the market looking to switch up your cleaning tools or you just don't like your dishwasher stuff, I would encourage you to go out and try different things that you normally wouldn't try um, because there's no point in doing something over and over again if you don't like it. So I'm doing a giveaway for whoever is watching right now. I'll probably wait a week, but if you subscribe to my channel, like my video, and if you comment on your favorite cleaning tool or your uh, favorite cleaning method or trick, um, I will pick someone and give them their choice of either this or this, and I will just send it to you. If you're interested, please comment, like, subscribe, and you'll be entered to win the giveaway. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you have a great week. Let me know if there's anything you wanna see for my channel and I love you guys.